Alright, this is going to be a little garage test. Uh, because I can't get my vehicle out of the garage because my brother's car is currently blocking me in. So, this is just to show my new LEDs that I replaced my halogens with. And a brightness test for them. So, this is the turn signals. Or the side markers. This is the fog. This is a fog with low beam. And this is high beam. Nothing on now. Now this is going to be the LEDs. Pretty bright. Again, they're not super bright like uh, the dualies or like a LED light bar would be. But they replaced my halogens and for being in here they're pretty bright. And this is them compared to the fog light. Compared to headlight. And high beam. So the headlights and high beams are fairly bright, brighter than these, but these aren't necessarily meant for long distance lighting like the headlights are. These are meant for close range, sort of have the flood pattern to kind of brighten everything around you. And again, here's everything off. And then headlight, low beam, high beam, fog light. All off LEDs. As you can see from a upfront kind of view, they're very bright, very clean. The Camera's probably not doing it any justice, but these are very clean, very white LEDs that we have. Not going to be the best view, but probably see LEDs. They have a projector on the front of them and then four LEDs around the side, which makes five LEDs. And they're 25 watt, if I'm correct. 25 watt H3 LEDs, Cree, made by the Cree company, I think. Here's a quick view with everything on. As you can tell, there's a significant brightness color difference where you got the regular halogens, headlights, fog lights, and then you got the white, clear LEDs. Alright, thanks for watching guys.